Today's player profile is both a shining light for the Czech capital city side Sparta Prague and also the Czech under 21s. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I am frankly FM84 and today we're coming back at you with another player profile. Today we are focusing on a player who has quickly become the darling of Czech football. Coming through the ranks at Sparta Prague, he has quickly established himself as a player of huge potential. At only 18 years old, he is a regular in the Sparta Prague first team and he's on the fringes of the national team while starring for the under 21s. But before we take a look at his player profile screen, if you've enjoyed the player profile so far, hit the thumbs up button. To stay up to date with all the player profiles, hit the subscribe button and let me know that you're enjoying the videos and who you want to look at next in the series in the comments box below. And I'll try and get through as many of those as I can. As you may have already seen, Today's player profile is going to be on Adam Holozek of Sparta Prague, a quick, dynamic player who has been linked to Dortmund in real life. So let's have a look at his stats as an 18-year-old winger. He starts off at Sparta Prague as a 3.5-star current ability and a 5-star potential ability player. He's six foot one, so he's on the tall side for a wide player, although he can play as an inside forward on both wings or through the middle as a makeshift forward. He has an ambitious personality and the media description of him is that of a winger. So let's talk attributes. His key technical attributes are dribbling of 12, finishing of 12, first touch of 13, penalty taking of 14 and technique of 12. His key mental stats are flair of 17, composure and aggression of 13 and a concentration of 12. In terms of his physicals, he has acceleration of 16, agility and balance of 14 and pace of 16. So for the purposes of this video, I have sim forward three seasons into his career to see how he develops. We are gonna have him spend one season at Sparta Prague before he makes a 12.5 million move to Atletico Madrid for the last two seasons. But before we see how he turns out, here's some clips of him in action so you can see the type of player he is and will become. In the first piece of footage I'm going to show you, you can see Helozek is at the top of the picture. As the ball is worked into the box, he is now at the back post, looking to arrive late. So when this ball is played to the back post, he's going to be there with a deft finish to knock it home. Here he's going to display brilliant awareness in and around the box. He holds the ball up and can see that he's got a teammate on the edge of the box. He lays it into his path perfectly so the player can just smash it first time in on goal and score. In this clip you're going to see the ball go out wide. When it's eventually crossed into the back post, Lozek is ghosting in behind the defender to rise highest and head the ball home comfortably. So similar to his assist from earlier, you're going to see him ghost into the penalty area. He lays the ball back into the path of a teammate who smashes it high into the roof of the net for his assist. In the last clip that we have, you're going to see a goal that's quite similar to the one from earlier. When the ball's out wide, you can see at the top of the picture, Lozek ghosts in between defenders and as he's unmarked, heads the ball home, scores a brilliant goal at the back post. Here we go then, let's take a look at the three year simulation that we did with Adam Hlozek's career. He is now a 20 year old player, only a month off of his 21st birthday. His personality has changed slightly to fairly ambitious and in a better team at age 20, he is now a two star current and three star potential ability player. He has now made his international debut and gone on to make 15 appearances for the national team. In terms of his technicals, his main technicals actually haven't changed. There are some progress on the non-focused stats that we were looking at earlier on, but it is minor changes. Surprisingly, nothing also changed in the mental attributes. There is progress again on the non-focused stats, but everything else is the same. And in terms of his physicals, he has actually lost while on pace and hasn't really progressed in the way that we thought he would. So let's have a look at his seasonal stats. 
In the first season, where he stayed at Sparta Prague, he managed to have 49 games, scoring 15 goals, 9 assists, for a 6.88 overall rating, a 6.92 rating in the league. In the second season, when he moved to Atletico for 12.5 million, he played 52 games, with 16 goals, 4 assists, and an average rating of 6.72 overall, 6.69 in La Liga. And in the third season, he played 37 games with four substitute appearances, scored 10 goals with one assist, 6.67 overall rating and a 6.70 La Liga rating. So even though his stats on the attributes page don't seem to have developed that much, he actually does seem to have turned into a quality player. Scoring goals, being in terms of goals, con goal contributions, I think he is a player who, once he develops and matures, he will go on and become a very good player. Maybe he's not quite there, maybe not quite top quality straight away, but I do believe he has the potential to grow into a brilliant player. Finally, we're going to look at his personal career achievements. So in that season at Sparta Prague, he was shortlisted for the Czech Player of the Year. He was named in the Czech First Division Team of the Week. Shortlisted for the Czech First Division Young Player of the Year. He was Czech FA Cup runner-up. Sparta Prague won the Czech First Division. He was the 2021 Czech First Division Young Player of the Year in third place. He was named in Sparta Prague's seasonal best 11 and then moved to Atletico where he won the Spanish Super Cup. He scored the winning goal for Atletico Madrid in the Spanish Super Cup final. He was a Spanish Cup runner-up and he was named in the Atletico Madrid seasonal best 11. Then in the last season he was inducted into the Atletico Madrid overall best 11 and named in Atletico Madrid's seasonal best 11. So nothing major in terms of personal achievements. But again, he's a 20-year-old player, just a month short of his 21st birthday. Maybe not a top, top class player. Maybe he needs to be in that second tier of clubs. But I do think he may still have lots of room to improve. So if you've enjoyed that video and you want to see further player profiles, please hit the subscribe button. If you've liked this player profile and you want to use Adam Hlozek in your save, hit the thumbs up button. If you've got anything you want to say about Adam Lozek or any recommendations for the series, leave them in the comments box below. I'll try and get through as many as I can. And until the next player profile or my next video, take care and I'll see you soon.